Today, we will be putting Logan Paul in today's WWE to see if he can win the WWE Championship in under one year. We will be going to Money in the Bank as the first pay-per-view. Let's see if Logan Paul can get booked. Oh, he's actually in the Money in the Bank match? No way. Imagine if Logan Paul wins. Oh, Seth Rollins walks out with the briefcase. That's all right. That's all right. Roman Reigns is still the WWE Champion. We definitely got to keep an eye out on the Tribal Chief. Well, if he was in the Money in the Bank match, surely he could get booked on Raw. Oh, am I right? Am I right? Nope, <laughs> not there. We're on the go home show for WrestleMania Backlash and he's still not there. Whoa, Seth Rollins cashed in on Raw and Roman Reigns is still the champ. It didn't matter, Seth. Well, it's time for WrestleMania Backlash. Can Logan Paul make an impact on the show? No, he cannot and Roman Reigns is still the WWE champion. Logan is not doing too hot, bro. This man got booked on one pay-per-view and hasn't been seen since. Oh, would you look at this? Logan Paul and Rey Mysterio are in a rivalry. Okay, wait a minute. Oh, but Logan Paul catches an L to Rey Mysterio. That was the go-home show for Extreme Rules. Let's see if Rey and Logan will have a match on the card. Here we go. It's not an Extreme Rules match, but it's Logan Paul versus Rey Mysterio. And Rey Mysterio gets another W. Oh, and Seth Rollins is the new WWE champion. Rey Mysterio is having a match against AJ Styles, and I got a feeling and Logan Paul is getting involved somehow. Rey Mysterio has had enough from his rival, taking out all of his frustrations and anger on Logan Paul with a furious attack. This superstar's perseverance and courage are being put on display after delivering payback. Damn, Rey Mysterio beating Logan Paul's ass. I bet a lot of y'all love to see that. <laughs> Rey Mysterio's facing AJ Styles again, and there's no way Logan Paul is not getting involved. Rey Mysterio was caught unaware after his match and was ambushed by his rival Logan Paul using his entrance music to draw attention to the stage while he was attacked from behind. Some people see this superstar as desperate and cowardly, but he may have inflicted the damage he wanted regardless of what people think. So Logan Paul making a statement against Rey Mysterio. This is the go home show for SummerSlam. Let's see what Logan Paul is up to. He's not having a match. He's just getting involved with whatever Rey Mysterio is doing. It ended in a draw no contest because Logan Paul came down to ringside while brooding as he watched his rivals match. He made his move after the match ended, attacking Rey Mysterio to start a brawl between the two superstars. Their hostility may be past the point of no return. Both of them wanted to beat each other in fights instead of matches. And they better have an extreme rules match or a no holds barred match at SummerSlam. Come on, it's the biggest party of the summer. Oh, but it's just a normal match. And Logan Paul is catching yet another L to Rey Mysterio. The rivalry for Rey Mysterio has ended. What is next for Logan Paul? Logan is still number six in the division. It is not looking good for him. He might not even have the WWE Championship by the end of this video. Oh, would you look at this. Logan Paul versus Mustafa Ali, and Mustafa gets the win. I don't even think Logan Paul has a win yet. Now that I think about it. Oh, these two are running it back, and Logan Paul gets his first win. Tensions are starting to build between superstars after Logan Paul won the match and offered to shake hands with his opponent. Mustafa Ali left the ring without considering it, the look of frustration clear on his face. Mustafa said, did I just get beat by a YouTuber, bro? <laughs> We're on the go home show for Clash of Champions and Logan Paul is facing Seth Rollins. Now, hold on, wait a minute. Seth Rollins is the WWE Champion. If Logan Paul can get this win, that'll definitely bump him up the division a little bit. Oh, but Seth Rollins is still getting the Ws. Tensions begin to thicken after a face-to-face -face confrontation between Mustafa Ali and Logan Paul after the match. Neither of them flinching as the crowd waited in anticipation. These superstars are ready to clash and find out which of them will come out on top. Well, for the sake of the video, I hope it's Logan Paul. We're here at Clash of Champions and Logan Paul has a match against Mustafa and Mustafa gets the win. It is not looking good for Logan Paul, bro. Mustafa Ali had a match on Raw. He defeated Cody Rhodes, surprise. But that's because Logan Paul delivered payback to his rival, winning over the support of the WWE Universe as they watch him give his opponent what he rightfully deserved. Wait, is Logan Paul a face? Wow, Logan Paul just made a face turn. That's pretty crazy. These two are going at it again, and Logan Paul gets another W. Mustafa Ali looked as if he was about to walk out of his match against his rival. The superstar's cunning drew Logan Paul right
right into his trap, knocking out his pursuer with a sucker punch. The cunning of this superstar makes him a dangerous opponent that will force his rival to be more cautious in the future. Gotta be more careful, Logan, when you face Mustafa Ali. Come on now. Of course, these two are going at it again, and Logan Paul is starting to stack up the W's. Tensions between Logan Paul and Mustafa Ali have grown out of control. The two superstars fighting with each other before the match could even start. The officials will have their hands full if things get worse between these rivals. But it is time for hell in a cell. What will Logan Paul be doing on this pay-per-view? Oh, I'm sorry. Premium live event. <laughs> oh my God. Logan Paul has a hell in a cell match for the first time in his career and Mustafa Ali gets the W. Mustafa Ali won his big match against Logan Paul. The crowd was disappointed at the outcome, feeling that he shouldn't have won after the lengths he went in the weeks prior to tonight. Hey, that's the way it's got to be sometimes. And would you look at that? The father beats the son. <laughs> Wait. We're now in January. We're building towards the Royal Rumble pay-per-view. Let's see if Logan can get booked at all. There he is. He's facing Roman Reigns. And Logan Paul beat Roman Reigns? What? That's actually pretty crazy. <laughs> Seems like Logan is trying to get a lot of momentum going into the Royal Rumble pay-per-view. Oh, and they're facing again. Run it back. And Logan Paul beats Roman again. What is happening, Roman? And it's a potential rivalry, too. That's crazy. Maybe Logan is one step closer to getting to that WWE Championship. He's beating the Tribal Chief twice back-to-back. -back. Here we go. Logan Paul versus Shelton Benjamin. And Logan Paul gets another victory. He's starting to come back a little bit. Oh, but here we go. Roman Reigns appeared on stage to applaud Logan Paul for a strong showing in the match. Could there be respect developing between these two superstars? Maybe. Just maybe. That was the go-home show for the Royal Rumble. Will Logan Paul be facing Roman or will he be in the Royal Rumble match? Or both. So Logan Paul is not having a match against Roman, but of course, Logan Paul is indeed in the men's Royal Rumble match. Logan Paul is coming out at number 29. That's crazy. Okay, let's see who is winning the Royal Rumble match. Kofi Kingston won the Royal Rumble. Good for Kofi. That's okay, Logan. The Royal Rumble is a hard match to win, but it looks like he's still in a rivalry with Roman Reigns. And these two are having a match. And Logan Paul has Roman Reigns' number, bro. Logan Paul took the win tonight and offered a handshake to his opponent, an admirable display of respect and sportsmanship. Roman Reigns slapped his hand away and left the ring, taking the loss hard with the frustration clear on his face. Could this be the start of high tensions between these superstars? Roman Reigns definitely does not appreciate losing to Logan Paul. Logan Paul is facing Seth Rollins yet again. Logan Paul has had a lot of momentum on his side. Can he beat the WWE champion? Oh my God, Logan Paul just beat the WWE champion. I think that makes Logan Paul one step closer to getting a match against Seth for the WWE title. It looks like Roman and Logan are going face to face after the match. These superstars are ready to clash and find out which of them will come out on top. Well, if I was a betting man, I'd have to say Logan Paul, which is so weird to say. <laughs> Logan and Roman are fighting at the pay-per-view and Roman finally gets his win back. I was starting to get a little nervous for Roman. So Logan Paul is facing Cody Rhodes tonight on Raw and Logan Paul with a big W. But wait a minute. Seth Rollins appeared on stage taunting the challenger after his match. The champion made a statement to everyone that he thinks Logan Paul doesn't pose a threat to his title reign, trying to put doubt into the challenger's head. Now keep in mind, I think Seth Rollins is just trying to play some mind games. Logan Paul beat him on Raw. I think Seth might be a little nervous. Logan Paul is going to be facing Cody Rhodes yet again, and Logan gets another win. This is insane. This is actually insane. <laughs> Logan Paul picked up a win on his path to his title match, but a face-to-face -face confrontation with the champion made things more interesting. Seth Rollins entered the ring and raised his title high, telling the challenger that he'll always have the advantage over him. I mean, that's not wrong. Seth Rollins is a multiple-time world champion. Can they coexist? <laughs> 
<laughs> Logan Paul and Seth Rollins are facing the Usos, but the Usos get the win. But we're going to fast lane, and you better believe Logan Paul is facing Seth Rollins for the WWE title. In a no-holds-barred match? Damn. Big stakes. Can Logan Paul win his first title in WWE? No, Seth Rollins gets the win. Not yet, Mr. Logan, not yet. We're building to the last pay-per-view. WrestleMania is almost here. Logan Paul is gonna have a match against Finn Balor and Balor gets the W. Seth Rollins delivered a brutal... Why did I say it like that? <laughs> Seth Rollins delivered a brutal attack to Logan Paul, intent on putting his bitter enemy through a world of hurt before their title match. The challenger refused to back out of the match regardless of the punishment and made it clear that he could take whatever the champion dishes out to win the title. We are on the go home show for WrestleMania. What is Logan Paul doing? Can't he make an impact? Logan Paul's not even on the card, bro. Seth Rollins is though. Seth Rollins gets the win over Finn Balor, but Seth Rollins came out with a win in his match and tried to send a message to the locker room after he threatened to shorten Finn Balor's career with a remorseless attack. Logan Paul couldn't stand by and watch, making a timely save and stopping the assault from happening. Well, shout out to Logan Paul. It is time for the WrestleMania pay-per-view. I can only imagine Seth Rollins is gonna be facing Logan Paul for the WWE title. Indeed, Logan Paul versus Seth Rollins for the WWE Championship. Can Logan Paul get the win? No, Seth Rollins is still the WWE Champion. Well, Logan Paul could not get the job done. He could not win the WWE title in under a year. Hey, but he had a great first year though. You can't lie. He beat Roman Reigns so many times. <laughs> if you guys enjoyed and want to watch more Universal Simulations, you can click right there. I'll see y'all next time. Deuces.